Hello, everybody. Well, when we learn about the story, tops and bottom about about the hare and his family that were planting plants, broccoli, and other vegetables for their land just to hide to help their family. But in order to do that, you had they were trying to ask Bear to help them. But Bear was just fall asleep. But let's see how it does. This is Barry. Hi, boys and girls. And this is Leo Jr. Hello, boys and girls. So, Leo, I'm going to ask you no. First, Barry. Barry. Yes? I'm going to ask you a question. What was Bear doing the entire day while Hair was planting vegetables. What was, it, what was Bear doing? He was sleeping like this. So, a question for you, Leo. Leo, was that right or wrong, what Bear was doing? That was wrong. Bear was supposed to help out the hair and his family planting crops and vegetables on the land. So yes, you're right. Bear was supposed to help out, but what was the what was the deal for Hair planting vegetables? Well, Hair was struggling making money, right, Leo? Yes, he was, because he does not own the land. Only Bear owns the land, not Hair. And his family, they were very worried about money problems, right? Yes, they were. So what was the planning to do? Find the land and working together by planting more vegetables. That is correct. And did Bear agree? Yes, he agreed that he takes half of the profit from this deal, the profit. Yes, he did. So who did all the work? No, sorry. Who was planting all, who was watering the plants, who was planting the plants, and who was cleaning the plants and weeding them? It was Hare. Hare was cleaning the plants. He plants the plants. His family watered them and weeded them. So they would look nice and beautiful and grow big. Yes. And did Bear help them? No, he was. He was sleeping. But what's your favorite part of the story? My favorite part is when Hare wakes up. Bear, like this. Wake up, Bear! Oh, I'm awake! <laughs> That's funny. Yes, I know. But was Bear... Well, what was Bear mad about Hare? He was mad of that Hare. Oh, he gives him the wrong... Hmm... The wrong vegetables. What does Hare gives him? It's just when Hare asks Bear if he wants the tops or bottoms. And you know Bear was always sleepy, so Bear asked for tops. Which is the tops were the what? The leaves. Yeah, they were the leaves and green. But another question. Yes. So what did the hare got? Vegetables, carrots, lettuce, no, um, radish, and beets. Yes. And what did the bear got? Leaves and green things. Which he was angry. Yes, but hare was being so nice to him and he was being really nice. Really, really nice. He gave him the tops and Hare keeps the bottom. So what are the bottoms? Reddish, bro no, reddish, carrots, and beets. There were the bottoms. So what were the tops? The leaves, there were the green things. And that's when Bear was not happy because Hare gets all the good things and Bear gets the bad things. 
But who plant them first? Who plant the vegetables first? It was Hare and his family. They planted all the work. And Bear was asleep. So as the season went through, again, harvesting, and when the harvest vessel comes, what did Hare did? He asked Bear if he wants the tops or the bottoms. Well, the, the Bear agreed. Yes, yes, he agreed. And he also told Hare not to trick him again. Just like the first time, it was really funny. Hi, Bear. We'll never learn his lesson. So, so when the harvest came, what the bear wanted? The tops or the bottoms of the vegetables? He wanted the bottoms. And what the hare chose? Tops! He chose the tops, and it was a darn good deal. But what happened? What the hair got from the tops? He got lettuce, he got broccoli, and he also got, hmm, reddish. I should reddish, reddish is bottoms. Oh, sorry. Weeds, he got weeds, I think. Well, I don't know, I don't remember. Sometimes it's hard to remember. So, he got reddish. No. He got lettuce, broccoli, and beans. I think, yeah, he got beans. Oh, thank you, mister. You're welcome. So what did Bear got? He got roots. What are the roots? The white stuff under the plants. It looks really dirty and yucky. So was Bear angry? He went to Hair the rabbit. Bad hair said it was a done deal with Bear. Then the bear said he wanted good things, not bad things. Ay, ay, ay. Bear would never learn his lesson. He did not want the tops, he did not want the bottoms. Bear is hard to understand, but, but the bunnies, the rabbits, they did all the work. And he did nothing! That's really mean. So, in the next harvest, was Bear asleep? No, he was harvesting his own plants and plunging them and watering them and weeding them and cleaning them. And what was Hare doing? Relaxing on the chair with his family with all his vegetables! So, what was the lesson that Bear learned? Is don't fall asleep, don't be silly, and don't be rude and disrespectful to your friends and neighbors. Because if they come to help you with something that's really important, then I suggest you help them out too as well. Good idea, Leo. And yours was good too, Barry. Why don't you give a good uh, advice to the boys and girls? It's always good to help out family. And also neighbors as well, and friends. Because when things are very important, like um, special events, like remember the harvest? Yes, the harvest, like roots and vegetables, and also like parties, and also other fun events. It's always better to help out, boys and girls, help out your family. Don't be silly, rude, and mean, and lazy, just like Bear. Yes, always be kind, thoughtful, and helpful, just like Hare the Rabbit. Yes. And always work together when you're making a deal. Because if you don't work together, you don't want to be like Bear. Wow, you guys get a good advice. Good job, you guys. Very proud of you both. Thank you. Thank you. So it's time to go, boys and girls. Yes. Have a good night, everybody, and always help on your family. If they need help cleaning up the house, you help them, okay? Yes, don't be rude, and don't be disrespectful to your parents, your brothers, your sisters, or family members, or your friends, okay? Good night, everybody. Sleep time. And don't let the dead box bite. Good night, good night. I guess they're going to bed. But... 
A very important lesson in Portugal is you help out your family. If your mother tells you to help her clean the kitchen, you help her out clean the kitchen, okay? And that way you could earn a, a nice treat or reward or something that you might get, like a prize. Bear did not get what he wanted because he was really rude and disrespectful. So, boys and girls, my advice is don't be like Bear, okay? It's always good to help your family. And then sometimes, um, I, get, I do be like Barry, but sometimes I like to help out my family. When it comes to parties or special events, I'm always like bringing the chairs or tables or decorating also for holidays. It's always good to help a family because this is what matters. The heart is what matters. The heart is what makes a good family and a good hardworking person and animals as well. The heart is the most important thing that we have, boys and girls. And that's what a hare and his family had. They had a heart because they needed money to help their family, their own family, just to help them out with their little bunnies as well too. But don't be like Barry, don't be rude, don't be disrespectful, don't be mean, okay? And no fighting, all right? Because then you don't want to be like Bear, being lazy, sleeping all day, every day. No, that is really rude. If you want to help your family and they tell you how me um, water the yard or plant vegetables, a garden. I'm planting an avocado because, well, three avocados, because I want to learn how to plant on my own. And I know, nah, I know how. See, it's better to be more outside with nature and also with family. That way you don't have to like be inside. Sometimes you can be outside in your yard, either help your dad planting a garden or your mom like helping her out for a party or decorating. It's always good to help out, boys and girls. Believe me, it's always good to help out. And Hare was a very good example of Bunny Rabbit because he was him and his family were both working together, planting the, the vegetables on the ground, watering them, cleaning them, because he wanted to help his family, and they wanted to help him too. But he made a mistake making a deal with a bear, the owner of the land. And bear was not very nice. He was very rude. He was very grouchy with hair and his family, and he was not very helpful. He was not helping out. He was sleepy which he should not be doing that. If you made a deal, it has to be a good deal and help out that neighbor out, okay? All right, I gotta go with you girls. Love you all. Have a good night. Wish upon a star that shines so bright and, have, and dream beautiful. Good night, everybody.